What's good, everybody? It's your boy, OG Kill. Back at it again. So tune in sometime today on my YouTube channel. It should be up on my YouTube channel as well as I got some different equipment. Um, like over here, my micro storyline. And current channel. We'll be Two to three games on this um, video. It'll be a little long, not too long. And MP, you keep on giving me interesting answers. Makes me want to come up with more interesting questions. Hey, look, what you got for me then? Okay, well, you know, since you've and a lot of other people have been talking about all the clothes you're wearing and all that stuff, I'm just wondering, like, can you sum up your game with one article of clothing? <laughs> it's 
something shiny, man. Something that catches your eye. Look, without me, this offense is dull, bro. I bring life to it, and I make it interesting. Now, look, I probably shouldn't be saying this, but the team, they need me. to get fans in them seats, and they just keep them awake, bro. Get me on the court, I'm like a diamond reflecting light all through the arena. Okay, so now that we know what it is, who's designing it? No, give me someone like Louis Vuitton. Always stylish, elegant, often imitated, but guess what? Never duplicated. Walk in with some Louis Vuitton and all heads turn. Same as when I step on that court. <laughs> Thanks, MP. I mean, I you are a fiery competitor on the court and a philosopher off of it. This sounds like a goodbye. You got the bill, right? Oh, well, you're in the NBA, so I thought maybe you would cover it. <laughs> hey, look, man, thank you for a great interview. I got it, man. You, you sure? get out of here. Yeah, I yeah. because we could split 50 50. I'll see you around, all bro. Right, man. MP, it's good to see you, man. Hey, I got some updates on the fashion label. Oh, yes, man. I finally feel like stuff's starting to move. What you got? <laughs> hey, man, it's exciting stuff. We locked down a designer, okay. secured funding, but I just don't see how we're gonna run this out the condo anymore, man. We need like a legit design studio. Well, y'all got a building in mind? Nah, I got two. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'll send you over the details right now. You go check them out. Let me know what you think. Okay. Now, the insides are all getting redone. So right now, they're basically empty. So you're just checking out the location and the outside of the building. Hey, are you trying to roll? Nah, I got a lot of stuff to do. So I'm gonna just catch up with you later. All right, cool. I'm gonna let you know what we choose, all right? Hey.
All right, we gotta go find a location. So I'm on my way to find a location. Right here. You know what I mean? We might take this one. No, that's right. We're gonna take this one right here. And we're gonna name this. We gonna name it. We got our building, you know. I got my bread. I said if y'all wanna know how to make this build, I can um, do a build video on it. Small forward, six seven, one eighty. To go again, we about to go. To game. Let me see what I got. I'm at 7k right now. I think I might want to do that because this is my my career build. Like I said, this is my my career build, not my park build. So I'm not doing too much on it. I may finish him off later on within the season, like when I, when I do my career, and y'all see everything is 
you know, maxed out. That's because I finished my park build and was working in the park. I'm not gonna upgrade them as of right now. But everything I got done. If I do upgrade, it might be this mid range. Just to give them a midi, but it'll be three. That's later on. I don't really gotta give them a midi right now because I don't really shoot like that. second half I mean I'll show y'all my stats I want to see right now I'm at 32 I'm at 32 I'm at 32 minutes before the game I haven't got a chance to get a chance to run up this I put myself at 32 keep Mike Conley at 32 keep Mike Conley you know at the one keep myself at 32 Jordan put Jordan Claxton at the three. You know? The only reason why my team is suffering right now is because you know Bodanovich is up there. He's a great player, don't get me wrong. Bodanovich is a great great. But you know, I'm really missing I'm really missing my man Hassan, bro. I'm missing Hassan so much. The reason why I'm missing Hassan so much is because me and him would dominate down in the box. I mean, Bear at center. You know what I mean? Hassan at the power forward spot. Me at the two. Claxton at the three. Deadly. You know what I mean? I decided to go for Utah Jazz. You know, I ain't, I ain't seen nobody with Utah Jazz content yet. You know, as far as my career. And, and I'm one out, one out of the millions of people, or one out of the three, who actually does my career videos. You know, like I said, I'm one out of the three that will do my career videos, and I will never stop doing my career. You know, I'm a mockery head. You know I mean? I'm not so much a park person. I play park, yes, but I'm more of a grinder. Plus, I'm more of a grinder in my career. I just don't take a build out and go to the park and say, hey, Shit, you feel me? Nah, it starts. It starts from home. You gotta start. And you gotta start in the NBA. Go out to the park. And a lot of, a lot. I think a lot of people, you know, forget that playing this game. And I, I think 2K, you know, hope Ronnie and Mike get a hold of this video. You know, I think they lost the sight of that. You know, where 2K is just 2K just going money hungry. They don't care. Give you the options a hey, hey. i give you the options to purchase vc to get your bill for 90 or 85 just so you could go out to the park and supposedly play good nah i'm sorry mike and i'm sorry and i'm sorry ronnie y'all need to take it back old school make these niggas go back to my career and learn how to grind learn how to play the game Go back to 2K10. Go back to 2K11. Those were the best 2Ks. I'm sorry. I don't care what nobody say. This new generation of 2Ks is suck. It sucks. Y'all need to go back to 2K10 and 2K11. Go back there. It all started in my career. It didn't start in the damn part. Now enough of my rant. Back to what I was talking about. Now let's let's get to this my career. We on the road, so I'm gonna throw, throw on these jerseys. We might, we, we might catch a dub today, you know, with these on. I did lose my first game, you know, thanks to my boy Gobert. Thank y'all for tuning in on Twitch, and I thank y'all for my supporters on YouTube. Clicking on my video and watching my videos, I appreciate y'all. Definitely appreciate y'all. I will definitely have some new stuff coming up. And just check out my channel. I definitely got some IRL stuff coming out. You know, 
I'm um, sticking on working on another channel. You know, as far as so, you know, as far as my family channel, you know, how to do content, joking around, stuff like that. Stay tuned to that, alright? So this build, this build goes fire. Got a little bit of dribbling in it. Not too much, I'm not a dribble head. I don't need the dribble to get open. shorts you know some shorts content some shorts videos definitely gonna be doing those so stay tuned for those shorts and the grizzlies start out with the yeah. ball you look at memphis well they notched a big win in the series opener trying to avoid a letdown here tonight greg what do they need to do to maintain their momentum you know kev first i think they need to weather that early storm they're gonna face a desperate opponent but once the game settles in it's about playing smart and playing energy you're the favorite for a reason, go out and show the world oh. what you're made of. I think yes, only hear that from you. That's, guy, that's, a, that's a great <laughs> piece of advice. I don't know. You ain't leave the NBA in blocks for nothing, bro. Come on, we got to lock in. Morant against Cobb. Five on the clock. Tries again. Good effort and good D right, by Boyan Bogdanovich. He was in great position. The Jazz working the ball around now. Conley with it. He's picked up by Brooks. Gobert trying to get open. He gets that one. Conley's got the opening bucket of the night here for the Jazz. Morant against Conley. The Grizzlies with another miss. Right, come on. Can't fault the play call, even though he could be hurt. That's a good shot. A shot by Clarkson, no good. For Memphis, they've gone 0 4, missing their first four field goals here. And that one's good, Morant. Right. I like this play. Good teamwork. You don't want to force Morant to do everything himself. To the inside, stolen by Brooks. And here in the first, closing in on two minutes play. Morant against Conley. Jackson with the screen. Here's Bain. A shot, no good. Good day by Bogdanovich. On the wing, MV. Good by Morant. And the rejection by Jackson. Gobert with a screen for Conley. To the paint. A second chance effort. John Morant grabs the rebound. The Grizzlies have gotten only one of six shots to drop for them to start this game. Jackson passes to Bain. Adams outside. Now here's Morant for three. And they force the shot clock violation. Let's He's go. checked in for Steven Adams. Kyle Anderson comes in for Jaron Jackson. The Anthony Melt. He's checked in for Brooks. And Jones subbed in for Morant. Then for the Jazz, Eric Pasco. He's checked in for Bogdanovich. Rivers comes in for Jordan Clarkson. Oh, and it's Butler Bogdan in for Mike Conley. That's two turnovers we got so far. Two. Now here's Melton. He's guarded by Rivers. Anderson is screen on Rivers. Melton kicks to Anderson. to the hoop and so it looks like the Grizzlies will retain position here Clark he's I'm off to the bench ain't doing nothing this game I 
They got me on Dylan Brooks. All right, it's time to work. It's time to put this man to work. And so Morant will bring it up, up for the Grizzlies. Trailing by two. And a chance mm -hmm. here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor. All fueled up and ready to go I'm for the start of the second games. quarter. So Taking a look at the Grizzlies. Adams at center three. with That's Jackson next to him. Then there's John Morant. Then there's Dylan Brooks. And it's Bain in at the two guard spot. And we've got an update here, so let's check yeah, in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Well, MP in the last matchup against the Grizzlies was terrific. He scored 40 points, and he did a great job of letting the game come to him, connecting on a number of his shots. It's rare to see any player put up numbers like that. It's likely a game he'll always remember. Kevin? Thanks, David. Greg, it was obvious. He was having a lot of fun out there. Tremendous victory. I'll tell you, he may have been enjoying himself, but whoever was matched up against him certainly wasn't. What I like is they just kept calling his number. Sometimes we see coaches go away from what's working, and we wonder why. It took him a while to get going, but here in the second quarter, he's found his rhythm. This one for three oh, he wide falls open. through. He's now made two of four. This is what I like about John ja Morant. He stays open to all options. Right there finds the open man. Some dishes to Hamilton. And he converts the layup. Hamilton's got six here in this quarter. Shut out in the first quarter. He's heating up now. I like the aggressiveness. Man. Brooks outside. Jackson sitting the pick here for Brooks. You can't get that one to fall. And it's Utah the other way. Something that's kept this game close is the fact that the rebound stats for both teams are almost identical. Oh, an aggressive move and fantastic finish. Mm, trying to send a message with that slam, I think. Morant drives in. Good on the shot. Morant's got his third basket of the night. Now you see him, now you don't. There's only a few players that are faster with the ball than John Morant. Clarkson finds MP. Pass to Pascal. Wide open. Again, the Jazz score. And 10 of their last 12 coming off. Anderson, he's checked in for Adams. And it's DeAnthony Melton in for Brooks. Bogdanovich is checked in for Utah. Mike Conley comes in for Composo. Morant against Conley. Now Jackson. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Just five to shoot. Go into the rack ah. with energy. And the D afraid to cut him off. Yeah, got to chalk that one up to some shaky defender. In a close game like this, everything has to be challenged. And everything has to be earned. And the rejection oh, by on, Jackson. Baby, man. You did that shit the last game. That's why we lost. And it's Morant at the elbow. And there's a minute 45 left to play in the first half. Jackson with the screen. Driving in. And Jackson throws it down hard. This is a big target coming off the pick and roll. This is why I'm missing her. This is why I'm missing her phone right now. This is why. Tillman. Game two, y'all. Game two. Wild on him through that two, first three. half. Absolute dynamite on offense. This the is game. his challenge to continue to dominate to help them try to close strong here in the second half. Taking a look at the Jazz, they've got Jordan Clarkson. MP is out there with Bogdanovich. 
And it's Rudy Gobert. And it's Conley in at the point guard. Terrific play call to give him a clean look at the rim. That's how you want to start the second half. Listen, put the ball in the hands of your best scorers and let them go to work. Keep it simple. Here's Bain. He's covered by Clarkson. Fires top of the key. Here's Adams. And a good offensive board. Oh, and he gets man. the bucket. Adams has got his Lighting. first two points. They're getting on a roll in some of the last three field goals have come yes, from the paint. Donovan's been killing me. Gobert the pass to Clarkson. He do something and he don't. Jazz passing it around. Hamilton kicks to Clarkson. Back to Hamilton. And MP throws it down. Oh, just solid on the one-handed slam. And guys, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. Here's Morant. Rebounded by the Jazz. Morant was talking that crap early. Hamilton right side. Get Bain Brooks. And Bain pulls oh, it down. The Grizzlies trail by three. Pass to Morant. Just a little over 90 seconds oh, going in the third three, quarter. Jackson a screen on Conley. Morant the bounce pass. Oh, and Jackson throws it down hard. Love the execution. John and Morant is big time, time at breaking down the defense in these sets. Here's Hamilton. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Hamilton's got oh. six here in this quarter. And at the offensive end, he's done about as much as they could have hoped for today. Conley against Morant. And here, and on home. Going, going inside. <laughs> and then Morant slams it in. As creative as they come, John Morant has a style that's specifically his. The drive by MP. Score that one for him. His eighth field goal. Eight for 11 on a very accurate night. Okay, Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Morant against Hamilton. 13 feet away. Here's Adams. And Adams with the slam. Big man plays by two. Jones comes in for Dylan Brooks. So Utah going with an almost entirely new group here. Eric Pascal, he's checked in for Rudy Gobert. O'Neal comes in for Bogdanovich. Butler, he's checked in for Jordan Clarkson. Composos subbed in for Mike Conley. And they haven't been able to turn it into a big lead, but their rebounding advantage. I'm back on the bench again. We lose it. And the Grizzlies leading by eight. Adams at center with Jackson next to him. Then it's Brooks. Then there's John Morant. And it's Bain in at the two spot. That's the lineup in the game for Memphis. Jackson with the screen. Gets it to fall. The bucket from Bain. And the Grizzlies lead by ten. I'm sorry. That's poor defense down low again. It's been a mismatch thus far in the paint. Hamilton kicks to Conley. Good, and the assist goes to MP. Mike Conley makes just enough of these to keep the defense honest. Morant against Conley. Morant surveying the D. Just five on the clock. Oats one up. Gobert with the block. A sensational defender. You have to know when Gobert is in the area. This is the shot you want right at the rim. He just couldn't deliver. Brooks the pass to Morant. Bain. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. But he just kind of stepping aside and letting him get to the rim. There's a reason, GA. The lead is what it is right now. It's a backbreaker for your defense, giving up easy buckets like that. Takes it from 10. Tries it again. And with that shot, the Grizzly lead is cut down now to just seven on the bucket from Rudy Gobert. 
on the boards. Gobert is unstoppable, easily winning himself a second chance look. Morant kicks to Jackson. And again, it's Memphis with the three. A late reaction defensively. He quickly takes advantage, grows their lead. You can't afford to give him space. Those kinds of mistakes have been the story of this game. Nice shot by Hamilton. If you came to watch a scoring battle, you're in the right place. Yeah, both teams trying to close out strong. These are the fireworks that fans came to see. Adams dishes to Morant. Into the lane. Make it five for ten with him in that bucket. The decision-making keeps like improving. John Morant that, um, looking position. comfortable operating and pick and rolls. MB finds Conley. Conley off the pick from Hamilton. Conley into the lane. Back to Hamilton. Over Brooks. Offensive rebound. Another shot. Crystal blows. Damn, it is good. Is that a foul? What world is that a foul? Hard work, and he has today made it look easy. That's a carryover from the way he played in their last game. All-out energy plays on his way to a huge performance. And Utah making a change here. Pascal's checked in. Here's Morant. Not going to go that time. And it's Utah the other way. The drive by MP. Out to Conley. Brooks against Hamilton. Back to Conley. Gobert with a screen for Conley. Hamilton right side. Nice D from Brooks. And the defense Bye, ready for him on that possession. They had to be because he is so strong in the paint. Morant is coming. Jackson is screen on coming up. Here's Morant. And then Morant rams it in. A guy who can lull you to sleep and then burst right past you. John Morant on the attack. No good from Hamilton. And it's Jackson with the ball, bringing it up for the Grizzlies. They have a nine-point lead. Payton for three. Right, open in the Good, and a nice assist from Morant. Baines got seven points. For Memphis. And they're fully in control now, but there were some tense moments, I thought, for them uh, throughout this game. Uh, listen, they certainly weren't coasting despite what the score looks like. I love the way they came together, though, when everything started to look a little dire and really put the hammer down. And this is a team right now that is really playing with swag. Yeah, and anytime you can go up 2-0, you are in the driver's seat. They, they are riding pretty high going into game three. And as one might have guessed coming into this game, it was indeed another big game tonight for John Morant. You have to appreciate the unselfishness. He kept the ball moving, kept everyone involved. Really enjoyable to watch. He's doing what he can do to pull them closer, but it's not enough. He needs more help. Yep, I didn't get that tonight. 20 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Lays it up off the glass. Can't guard him. Moran's got the lead up to 12 now for the Grizzlies. And you know they feel good giving their fans a show here while taking care of business. They're going to win by a nice margin. The effort was there all night. So no problem for Memphis as they get the win. And this win puts them straight.
fast. I'm gonna figure out another game. Now we at home. Let's see what we do at home, man. Because, yeah. We need. We need a bounce back. We need to win two games at home. We need to win two games at home. If we don't, our season is completely over. Grizzlies start out with the ball. You look at the Jazz. This is a must-win game for them after they were unable to steal either of the first two. Yeah, must-win indeed. Falling behind 3-0 as the lower seed is a death sentence. This team wanted a better round one performance than they've had so far. Hard work from the boards. A lot of competition for that one. But he's got the limp to be the first one, too. Here's Hamilton. Oh, a beautiful reverse layup. Oh, just an easy reverse for him. He has nice feel and touch around the bucket. Moran against Conley. Pass to Bain. Jackson with a screen on Clarkson. To the inside. Here's Bain. Clock at four. Jackson pass to Moran. There's the triple. Clarkson grabs a miss. That's his shot. And one, I'm sure, he wants back. Here's Hamilton. Up and over Brooks. Shot by Hamilton. No good. Pass to Bain. Morant with it. Over Conley. Off the left rim and out. Oh, he did everything right there except hit the shot. And there's Clarkson. That one's good. On the assist by MP. The thing about Clarkson, he really plays with an edge, especially once he gets it up inside. Adams with a screen on Conley. Shot's good by Moran. Just taking it right to the rim, and no one was there to greet him. Yeah, very little resistance. I mean, you had to bring much faster help than that. He'll take advantage of that kind of soft defense every time. Just give him a chance to attack the basket, and he will. Brooks, the pass to Jackson. Back to Brooks. And it's flushed down. A nice Come on, game. That's a block. He's improving as a passer. You like to see Jackson sharing the ball and realizing when his guys are open. To the middle. Gobert finds MP. Conley against Moran. Picked by Gobert. Conley passes to MP. Knocks it loose. Oh, Brooks with the steal. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. Conley against Adams. Oh, it misses. Had a chance to tie it. Down low. Here's Hamilton. Knocked loose. Up and over Brooks. Hamilton with the bucket. MP's got six. He's got the hot hand right now. Most entire new group here. Pascal, he's checked in for Gobert. O'Neal comes in for Bogdanovich. Rivers is checked in for Clarkson. And Butler is subbed in for Conley. Now here's Jones. Melton outside. On the take. Clark right side. Outside Jones. Here's Anderson. And that one's long. Utah leading. Butler finds MP. The six-footer. It's rebounded by Memphis. Melton outside. And we're just over three and a half minutes into this first quarter. to Anderson. Here's Jones. Nails it from beyond the arc. Well, this is the attitude Anderson brings. A selfless player. Who... Oh. 
this year. Memphis shooting just 38%. Their offense not where they want to be. On the court for the Grizzlies. Jackson Jr. and Adams together inside. Ja Moran is out there with Desmond Bain. And it's Brooks in at the three spot. What athleticism from Brooks. You can't let him get this kind of positioning. See why right there. And Utah has possession. Following the bucket by the Grizzlies. Count that one. MP's got eight. Nice pass. I mean, putting in work on the interior. Gotta love it. Adams a screen. And it's Moran off the drive. He hits that one. Two for five now. And when Morant explodes toward the basket, you're toast. He loves penetrating the finish. Pass to Gobert. Back to MP. Kicks it out to Clarkson. Pascal sets the screen. Off target with the three. Memphis trailing here. On the wing, Brooks. Defended by Gobert. Nice move. Moran. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. love for the game is so obvious and you can tell it affects his whole team out there. Bogdanovich has checked in for Utah. Conley comes in for Campazzo. Here's Hamilton. Lays it up and in on the nice reverse. He's got 10. His individual effort has been outstanding tonight and it's helped him grab the lead. Moran against Conley. Jackson left side. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. And then jumps out on the scouting report. Jackson is quite the offensive talent. To have a big who's great at the line, such a plus. Conley finds Gobert. And MP throws it down. The great read between those two guys. The defense didn't stand a chance, B.A. These two teammates right here, Grant, they are connected. Now here's Moran. He has six. And again, Memphis no good. Gobert passes to Clarkson. Back to Gobert. Adams against Clarkson. Over Adams. Oh, Adams with the block. And he's able to get it back. Down to five on the shot clock. Back to Clarkson. Puts up a three. And Moran clears the board. And that puts them just one foul from the bonus. Anderson's That's checked in for Brooks. Are you kidding me? The Grizzlies have got two of three shots to go in the second. Anderson passes to Jackson. Back to Anderson. And finished off by Anderson. He's not much of a dunker, but... <laughs> He's checked in for Clarkson. And Memphis also making a switch. Melton's checked in. Thanks. Well, MP in their last game against the Grizzlies delivered quite a performance. He dropped 23 points, and plus, he nabbed a couple boards. A superstar performance, which has become the norm for him. Back to you. Great work. Thanks for that. And there's always the chance of a carryover effect into tonight's game. I wouldn't put it past him, but it's tough to have back-to-back -back performances like that. Yeah, well, he made it look easy last time. Huh? I mean, he's in sync from the get-go. We'll see, though, if he can replicate that rhythm tonight. Still plenty of time for him to contribute in this game, but it's a tough stretch he's going through. And guys, what do you think about the hustle stats for the Jazz? They deserve a lot of credit for the defense they played in the paint here early. Contesting shots, blocking shots, just making life difficult on the opposing shooters in general. The other thing that's been effective so far tonight is their fast break. A lot of points coming on the run. Shot by Hamilton, no good. For Memphis, they've gotten five of eight attempts to drop since the second began. Melton passes to Moran. Anderson with a screen on Conley. The drive by Moran. Can't get it to drop. Good D by Gobert. It's been an ugly quarter for him. Trying to shoot his way out of it. Might be time to work on the playmaking skills. So often we see guys fail to box out now. 
but he did a great job right there. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. His offense has been non-existent tonight. This really hurt me. Here's Hamilton. That one's good. On, and it's Conley who picks up the assist. MP's got 16. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. Jackson with a screen on Conley. Moran finds Jackson. To win the run. And he lays it in. Jackson's gotten four this quarter. Just like his pops, Jerry Jackson Jr. can pour it in close to the hoop. You can't let him get the ball in that deep. Back to Butler. Pass to Conley. MP right side. Second shot opportunity. And he sinks the layup. 18 points for him. He's not playing around. I mean, he hit the ground running the first quarter, and he's only turned it up in the second. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Boyan Bogdanovich. That'll be a second. Utah leading. They've got MP. Rudy Gobert is out there with Boyan Bogdanovich. Then there's Mike Conley, and it's Clarkson in at the shooting guard position. That's the group for Utah right now. Inside. Stolen by Conley. To the inside. And it's Bogdanovich that time on the assist by Conley. They're finding ways to get the ball into the paint. Five consecutive buckets. Here's Moran. Softly drops in the floater. That shows great imagination offensively. Moran has so many tricks up his sleeve. To the paint. And MP throws it down. <laughs> Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. To the middle. Oh, MP Utah, with a block. Dude. On the wing, MP fires for three. Drops in the three. And it's a nine-point Utah lead. The assist numbers certainly stand out. They've really emphasized ball movement here today. Jackson with a screen on Conley. Morant. And then Morant with the jam. Are you for real? <laughs> Morant way, way up. Five. They've got this lead because he's at the top of his game. He has been the story. Down low. Here's Moran. Yes. And a nice assist from Jackson. Jackson's got his fourth assist in this one. Oh, the movement off the ball is good. I mean, and the pass to hit him in stride is even better. And he recovers it. Oh, the strong defensive instinct. Jackson excels at recognizing when he uses his lip and go for the block. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. Morant into the lane. Lays it up and banks it in. Morant's got eight points in the quarter. It's all clicked into place for him this quarter. He's not missed a single shot. Here's Hamilton. Grizzlies with the rebound. Morant's got five rebounds in the game. Clarkson against Brooks. Pass to Moran. And Moran gets double teamed from deep. Bain buries it from three. And now it's just a four point. This entire new group here. Pascal, he's checked in for Gobert. O'Neal comes in for Bogdanovich. Rivers is checked in for Clarkson. And Butler is subbed in for Conley. MP drives in. Anderson pulls it down. For Memphis, they've got five of six shots to fall so far in the third. On the wing, Jones. 
Back to Melvin. Outside, Anderson. Over MP. Anderson can't get it to go. Boy, you love how guys are making plays for one another here. Yeah, just a balanced attack, a total team effort. Pass to Rivers. Inside. Oh, got a piece of it. And stolen by Melton. They've got the five on three advantage. Now Jones. Here's Tillman. 116 left in the third quarter. He can't hit that time. Now the Jazz take it the other way. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. Outside Butler. MP drives in. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Earning his money on the interior tonight. That's a nice move. Memphis trailing here. Anderson for three. Nails it from three. Anderson's got five now. And this shot has to give Anderson confidence. I mean, it's, it's one he continues to try to hone over time. Pascal passes to MP. Yep, that one's good. And the Jazz lead by five. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Anderson against MP. Clark with a screen on MP. And the ball goes out of bounds. Nice nice. touch by MP. For the Jazz. House comes in for... game has been great tonight. So much of their scoring has come from the paint. The other thing, they continue to fill it up from three-point range, making it look easy. A chance here to catch up with Ali from the sideline. I was able to listen in on what Taylor Jenkins had to say to his team. He asked his players to really push the tempo. He wants to see quicker transition into the open court so they have a chance to score before the defense can set up. Trying to use their speed to full advantage, guys. Okay, thanks, Ali. On the court for Memphis. We've got Steven Adams. Dylan Brooks is out there with Brandon Clark. Then there's the Anthony Melton. And it's Moran in at the one spot. Shots good by Moran. Oh, welcoming the physical defense on the way up. Moran enjoys overcoming these types of challenges. MP is doubled. Back to Rivers. The three is up. Good. Nah. And the assist goes to MP. Ooh. MP's got four assists in the game. And that's a clutch shot by a big-time shooter. And where's the D? Morant, no good. Utah's got two of five threes to go here in the fourth. MP finds Gobert. Back to MP. With the drive. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Oh, you love to see that kind of vision from Gobert. As much attention as he draws from the D, there's bound to be an open man, and he just got to find him. Clarkson's checked in for Utah. Jackson, he's checked in for Memphis. Payne comes in for Melton. Conley against Moran. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We played about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter here. Still a little bit of a streak shooter, but Morant has been deadly accurate tonight. Oh, and the dunk by MP. He is torching a defense that simply has no answers for him. Moran against Conley. Steps back and shoots. No good off the front rim. For Utah, they've gone 5 of 11 so far in the fourth. The drive by MP. The kick out to Conley. Here's Hamilton. And Moran clears the board. The Grizzlies shooting only 42%. One oh three left in the fourth quarter. MP is doubled to the wing, right side. 
Conley passes to MP. Yes, great play by Conley to set it up. And now it's a nine-point Jazz lead. I love the awareness. Conley is a deck to read the defense and realize when this guy's mm -hmm. here. Yeah, Hell Adams no. On the screen on Conley. Morant, no good. Don't do anything silly. Just ride out the clock. Yes, if they take their time and execute, no, the game is all there. Yes. Stepping no. up and nailing an important shot to put this away. That's the dagger. You could tell they wanted that one. I know that's it. Moran against Conley. Opponent showed. I mean, they're more willing to put Morant on the line than give him an easy look. There's 18 seconds left in the fourth. Here's Hamilton. Oh, and the dunk by MP. They got a big lift from their crowd tonight, giving them the energy they needed. That's why they're in the driver's seat right now, looking to put this one away. Morant, the pass to Melton. The three. And so it's Utah easily grabbing this one. Things were looking scary for them coming up. It's your boy OG Kill signing out. See y'all tonight at 7. Stay up, stay fly. Boy Kill, and I'm out of here. Peace.